sad Harry Potter headcanons, which he has not had since a year after the Battle of Hogwarts. After Voldemort's fall, Harry developed post-traumatic stress disorder because he was constantly afraid that Voldemort would somehow manage to come back. The day Neville told his parents about what Molly Weasley did to Bellatrix Lestrange was also the first day in 17 years that Alice and Frank Longbottom could smile again. Sirius and Harry were both so traumatized by James's death that they saw each other as a replacement for James and could never see the actual person behind it. Hermione visited Lavender's grave every day because she couldn't forgive herself for having wished her dead during the entire sixth year out of jealousy. Sometimes, when George had a drink, he would stand in front of the bathroom mirror and pretend to talk to Fred. Until the day he died, Lupin couldn't look in the mirror without hating what he saw. <laughs>